the man was like, so can I get your number just in case there are more packages for you? And I'm like, trust me, when there are more packages for me, my number is going to be on there so you can call me to like deliver. And he's like, are, are, are you sure? And I'm like, yeah, trust me, I'm sure. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm home. Haven't picked up my camera in a while, but at this point that's nothing new. Yesterday I was off and I slept so much. I can't even, I slept so much. I went to sleep at around four o'clock. I kept waking up at like around four hour intervals, but then I went back to sleep. And this morning when I woke up, it was 2 a.m. And I've been up since 2 a.m. Right now it is 2.20 p.m. So that's great. I'm trying to back up my phone because I just got the new phone. And while my last backup was yesterday and was successful, I need it to be backed up right at the moment. Just because, what have I done since um, yesterday that is so important? Probably nothing, but still, I'd like for it to be backed up now. I just picked up some mail downstairs as well since I was down there. Here are my boxes. Oh, this is from Amazon. This is also from Amazon. I think this one, there's a phone case in it because I had it outside since yesterday. My neighbors brought it in to like the foyer. This one, it's probably hairspray because it's the cooler months and in the cooler months, I wear wigs. And this is my phone. Let's start with the bigger one first. And you guys, I'm telling you, I was going off on my Insta stories this entire time about me waiting for this package from UPS. And considering the fact that it's an iPhone, I think it's going to need a signature. I called them. They're saying, oh, no, it doesn't need one. I took the initiative to write a note and put on the door. That said, call me when you get here and I will personally come down and pick up the package. And thank God the man listened. So I bought this cute little phone case from Amazon. You guys know how I am with these phone cases. I hope the buttons work. It already feels kind of crazy. But, um, make your life colorful. So cute. I love this. Okay, whatever. Thank me for my service. But this feels nice and sturdy. Oh, the buttons already feel a little bit crazy. They're supposed to be protruding a little bit more, and they're not. So I'm going to have to write the people, but for now, maybe I'll... So, I just took the opportunity to go put my Apple Watch on because it's one thing about these new phones. Once you start setting them up, your phone is going to be out of commission for a while. Let me see where we're at with the backup successful. Great. I got this in the box as well. I got, yeah, the phone case, like I said. Let's put a little sticker on it. Yeah, I can't remember what I was saying last, but this is the phone. So cute. But there is nothing crazy to it, really. I mean, there is, like, the camera quality and all about outside of that. I always get the gold. Because if not the gold, nothing else really makes sense. And, you know, the standard things that comes in the box, the charger wire, um, yada, yada, yada. I'm going to put... The They've stopped making it with the SIM card slot. Oh my gosh. I mean, I knew that they said they were going to make it without it, but. They really have. Because it, sh it should have been on this side. And it's not. But for the most part, they kind of Oh look. my god! Okay! Okay. They kind of look the same have a tempered glass I should probably put that on right at the moment so I'm gonna go get that I'm gonna put it on and come back so guys like I stated the only difference so far outside of the camera quality obviously I have it turned on but I don't have anything set up is like the little notch where like the other thing was I have a tempered glass on there right now but it's not ideal it's a little bit different okay minor differences all right whatever so I'm going to start transferring things and I put my Apple watch on so that I can like continue getting messages through my watch or whatever the case is while the phone is out of commission because as we know it will be out of commission and the pop-up is already there to like set up the new one and they have a little thing where you hold this over like it's just pretty easy to like start the setup to be honest and like I said because I just I just backed up the phone everything that's going to go on there is everything that's on the old one, this is going to take a while. Right now, why is it saying it's 8.43 p.m.? It's 2.39 p.m. 
it's saying it's gonna take a few minutes so normally I'll have like oh the notch at the top you see how it extends so cute when you do anything it look like it you know set up eSIM transfer from iPhone I don't know how I feel about eSIM So whatever you're trying to do on here, it allows, it asks that you confirm it on here. So far, everything is going fine. I really hope that Apple has like a quicker way of like transferring shit on these phones. All the time change to 240. Right now it's 240 p.m. We're going to see how long it takes for everything to transfer. For now, it's going. So I'm going to watch some Dynasty and something else that I've been watching on Netflix while the time passes to like set this up and like I said I have my Apple watch on so I could continue getting messages because the last time I was really shit out of luck in terms of like <laughs> nothing was ready I don't think I was prepared let me try putting it in this new case and see face ID I hate this part truly truly I'll have to go back later and set up face ID with a mask because it wasn't quite doing but the phone case is cute there's like a lot of air bubble in the phone. And as soon as I'm done, I need to go on. Oh, it's gone. I need to go on Amazon and buy the proper um, tempered glass with the privacy screen for this one. Because on this one, there's like a little dot over here by the camera. On this phone, it's on the opposite side. It's over here. So the one that I have is for the dot on this side. And the other one opened up the notch. But I make this transfer to your new phone easy. Okay, so we're about to just set up the phone and come back later. So I ended up straightening my hair yesterday and um, Jules said that the ends could do with a trim. They definitely could. But here's the thing, this is not gonna be straight. It's okay though. We're gonna just... The scissors is not even for here. Guys, the FedEx man Slick tried to get my number just now. He said that he dropped off a package yesterday. I randomly went downstairs because I remember that I had something delivered. And he's like, oh my gosh, you guys check the mailbox because I left something for yesterday. And normally I will check it. But this morning I was tired like a dog. So honestly, I did not. And I'm like, oh my gosh, let me check. It is the return box for my iPhone to just like put it back in so you can like ship it out. And so... I'm like, oh my gosh, let me just go put it back quick so I can send it to you. Only to find out. He isn't even the one who gets it anyways. It's, um... Let's trim it again. And, you know, it's just hair. It'll go back. Okay. Great. So, I bought this laptop for my daughter. And... If I've learned nothing else this entire year, it wasn't even supposed to be delivered today, but I think that is indeed what it is. Super Prime Shop, it did say that. If I've learned nothing else this entire year, it is to not throw away the boxes. So, so. It's an Acer computer laptop. She had a, um, she had an HP before, but there wasn't much storage and a whole host of other things. I think there should be charger Jadine keep this box remember what happened the last time you found out it was a Chromebook and you had to send it back okay, okay Jadine you keep it my mom should be coming soon which is the reason why I wanted to get this now so when she's here it's very cute full HD 10 DP She's very cute. She's going to high school, so she'll definitely need this. Please make the resolution nice. Not that that matters or anything. Built-in Alexa. Turns out this was a good purchase. I'm going to have to set this up for her, but I think I'm going to leave that for tomorrow when I'm actually... Oh. just in case there are more packages for you and I'm like trust me 
when there are more packages for me, my number is going to be on there so you can call me to like deliver. And he's like, are, are, are you sure? And I'm like, yeah, trust me, I'm sure. Deliver. Okay, this I'm going to have to set up tomorrow because I don't really have the time right now. Jackets from Mr. I'm going to buy myself some cute little things. Oh my gosh, you guys, I bought this cute little cropped sweater. Is this not so beautiful? It's a little blazer. Let's see. I'm not really a blazer girl, but... I bought it in a medium. I think it might be a little oversized. But... It's... Oh, that's nice. It's kind of thin. Wow, it's giving. She can attend a Zoom meeting and look kind of professional. This is cute. It's very lightweight. It's not like too thick or anything. Whenever am I going to need a blue? I feel like I've really been feeling blue though. Probably has something to do with my new scrubs that I've been wearing to work because they are indeed light blue. And prior to now, that would never be a color that I chose for myself. So maybe it's just that now I'm realizing that light blue kind of looks cute on me. Oh, this I'm so excited about. I bought some things for my mom and for my daughter on there last night this morning. Please fit how I'm expecting you to fit in my head. Wow, what did I have in mind in my head? Did it fit this low on? I don't know if it fit this, um, I can't tell if it fit this low on the girl, on the, on the thing, but another case of what I bought versus what I got. I don't really know. I'm gonna have to see. Okay, whatever. Oh, well, this is so cute, but it's so thin. But it's so cute. I'm excited for these little color schemes. This one is also another knit number. Very cute. Okay, UPS, I got it. I bought these little pairs of like slip-ons because everybody knows the little shoes that I be wearing all the time. And these little things get lost so much. It's when you're looking for them, you can never find them. I think I said it the last time I did a haul. I love going on there and seeing what they have on the Shein flash sale because you get some nice little items that are heavily discounted because obviously it's a flash sale. If my mom ends up coming in like a week or two, like she said, I'm probably gonna have to end up borrowing this and lending it to her because. Oh, there's another one that I can lend her because I don't think she has a winter jacket here anymore. Oh, wait. Actually, she never had a winter jacket here because the last couple of years she's been coming in like the summer months. So all the stuff that I do have here for her are some... Oh, no. I bought her a jacket on the flash sale this morning. But um, that's all for now. I'm supposed to get two more items in the mail, but it's quite literally just a sleeve for the computer and um, a bag. So maybe tomorrow when I'm setting that up, I will come on here and show you guys that because tomorrow I'm off and maybe we will, call, we will talk about like a little test that I have to do at my job. I'm just not so excited about. That's it for today. It's currently 3.38. I think I'm going to get myself together and like go to sleep. I have this package to drop off. Maybe I should take it to work with me t and tomorrow just drop it off at the FedEx. Hey, sorry. Remind me tomorrow morning at 8.15 a.m. to drop off my phone at the FedEx. That's all that's going on for right now. i got to clean up this place here. And get rid of the packages. I should get Tootsie some stickers for her computer. Well, I have one sticker here. Good morning. <laughs> oh, but yeah, later, girl.